So I'm going to be going through five different fixes if you're having issues connecting S Pennant to your Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. Now this is frustrating because S Pennant is a very useful thing to use on this phone because it's got that massive 7.6 inch display. Now obviously the first tip here would just to reboot your Galaxy Z Fold 5 and see if that takes care of the problem. Now the next thing you need to do is ensure you're in Bluetooth range when you're using your pen. And this might sound weird, but uh, yeah, uh, I'd also recommend maybe toggling the Bluetooth settings on your Z Fold 5 on and off to see if that fixes it. Okay, the next thing you could do is scan or reset S Pen from your settings. Now, I'm going to hold this up to the camera for you guys so you can really see it, but in your settings, you want to scroll down to where it says Advanced Features. Now, in here, you've got Labs, S Pen, and Side Buttons. Now, when we click on S Pen, you're going to see that right now it's turned on, but what you can do here is turn it off and on. You can also click scan for S Pen Pro. Now when you do this, it's gonna start scanning and you're gonna see that it's gonna tell you to press and hold the connection button on your S Pen for three seconds until the LED starts blinking, so you can try that. Okay, on to the next tip. Uh, if you're using a case on your phone, I would recommend taking it off completely. The next thing you can do is actually enable extra sensitivity settings. Uh, this is going to be in your display settings. So what you want to do here is uh, go to the, the display section. You want to scroll down until you see the touch sensitivity. And then you want to click the simply enable and toggle it to on. Okay, uh, the next thing you can do, and this is going to be the last thing, is to just check to see if you have any software updates. Now, software updates are always good to check for because it'll fix any glitches you're currently experiencing on your phone. And this could also take care of the problem for you guys. Anyways, those are my tips. If you're having some issues with S Pen not working on your Z Fold 5, I know it's frustrating, but you know, hopefully one of these helps you guys out. Okay, anyways, um, I'd also like to point out that you guys can get on our tech newsletter where we send out one email a week on only the good stuff directly below in the description. As always, thanks for watching this, guys, and we'll see you all in the next video.